Hey guys, it's Tubes. I'm just here at Ability Fest, uh, chilling out. <laughs> I got into DJing a long time ago uh, when I was a kid. I've always loved electronic music and dance music. And then my dad bought me a pair of decks and yeah, I was like 12 years old when I got those decks. And I didn't even know uh, how to use a pair of decks at the time. Yeah, I'm self-taught. So I literally just sat in my room by myself with my headphones, just trying to figure out what button does what and what knob does what. And then I think after, you know, a few years, I figured it out. Yeah, ever since then, I kind of just been you know, as a hobby, just playing to myself. But uh, as I was just kind of learning to DJ, yeah, basketball was a huge part of my life. So for the last 10 years, I'd been I'd been playing wheelchair basketball and uh, I was hugely passionate about it. And yeah, that was basically my day to day. Yeah, last year I got to go to the World Championships with the Australian Rollers, um, which is the Australian men's team. And yeah, that was an amazing opportunity. Um, but you know, I just kind of wanted to give something else a go. Music inspiration, Daft Punk, they're a classic. Just the way they've always evolved their sounds and just the kind of the place they have in electronic music and dance music. Also, Paul Johnson's another huge inspiration of mine um, in terms of like representation and artists that, you know, that a wheelchair uses or someone with a disability. You know, that was someone that I could look at. Oh, where do I start? Uh, what can they learn from Ability Fest? Just I guess all the considerations and all the inclusions they've made for, you know, for the, so many, you know, the diverse people that, that attend these, these these festivals. I think access is probably the broadest thing, but but uh, yeah, just obviously making sure people are comfortable, people are enjoying themselves, and you never get just one type of person. Like it's just, you know, you, you feel like everyone is here. Yeah. I'm just excited to give it a go, really, and uh, hopefully people enjoy it. Yeah.